need to have a conversation about Dr. Disrespect and this whole situation revolving Twitch and everything else. First of all, what the fuck, Dr. Disrespect? Because you were living the dream. You kept it alive. You were the two-time fucking blockbuster back-to-back -back game fucking champion. What the hell happened? Like, I still sit here and reminisce with my friends sometimes about the fact that there are men our age playing video games for a living, living the fucking dream, when if you would have told us this back in like 2005, 2006 era that you could just make a living and a damn good living, get rich damn near off of playing video games, we would have told you you were absolutely crazy. And yet you were able to do it. You were able to make the dream happen and keep hope alive for the older fucking generation here. And yet here you are getting caught exchanging messages of an inappropriate nature with a minor. Like what in the actual fuck, bro? But I can't necessarily say that I'm surprised because at the end of the day, what do we really know about you? What do we know about these big streamers? What do we know about these large influencers with a large following? What do we know about celebrities? We really don't know anything at all. Hell, he doesn't even look like that. He just hides behind this uh, wig and fucking glasses all the time to stream as a character that he is pretty much portrayed. And evidently, this unraveled a whole can of worms of Twitch because he was not the only one found and caught. So I didn't even know Twitch like had a messaging system or whatever, but nevertheless, Less, there needs to be like a deep launched investigation into Twitch and what the hell is going on over there. And now look at you, you've been reduced to being called like Dr. Diddy, Dr. Disrespect, his wife and kids, the list goes on. And let me tell you something that, boy, if you make it to prison with those charges, they are not going to like that whatsoever. So hopefully you got some money saved up to pay for some protection. We don't care if you are 6'8 or not. Trust me, there is somebody on that compound that's willing to test that theory and see how disrespectful you can be.